Search Previous Repair Orders. You might find you need a copy of a previous repair order. Well, there are a couple of different search criteria you can use to find that previous repair order. Let's take a look. On the service counter, click the Options button on the side toolbar, or you can right-click anywhere in the service counter list box and select Search Previous Repair Orders. And here we can select to search by repair order number, repair order date, or date paid. Let's select to look by repair order date and click on this button here on the right to open the calendar. And I know it was last week, so I'll put in Monday the 10th and click OK and OK again to bring up our search results. And here's my RO for Sam, dated the 12th. So this search brought up every invoice started since my search date of May 10th, since we looked by invoice date. We can double click or just highlight the repair order and click the View Repair Order button to open this repair order. If these repair orders weren't already posted, we could have clicked the Edit button and this would have opened up the actual repair order on this service counter, but this one is closed, so the Edit button is grayed out. Let's try another one. So this one has a status of work in progress. See? Now the Edit button is active. If we just double clicked on this RO, it would take us to the View mode, like using this button. So let's highlight that repair order and click the Edit button. And here we are in the live actual RO. We could start working on this RO right from here, and you'll see we've left the search window. Let's go back into the search and select by date paid instead. Click on the button on the right, again for the calendar. We'll select the 10th again, and here is Sam's invoice, RO date of the 12th, and date paid of the 13th, and the total amount. So if we search by date paid, all these ROs will be posted, so none of these will have an active edit button. They're all already closed. Last, we can click the Find button to search again, and this time we'll search by RO number. We'll enter 10,025, and here are all the invoices from number 10,025 onward, with their customer, statuses, date started, all here. We can click the Print Repair Order button to preview that closed RO in printing format. See how paid. We can click Print up here to reprint that invoice. And click anywhere on the RO to zoom or use this Zoom button. And we could use these Spin buttons to view multiple pages if this repair order had more than one. Let's click Close. And a side note for MotorTrax users with converted ROs. You may have noticed you cannot reprint any ROs that were created in MotorTrax but converted into MaxTrax Pro CE. You would need to access those converted ROs using this feature to reprint them. But going forward, all ROs written in MaxTrax Pro CE can be reprinted directly from the History section. And this concludes the lesson on Search Previous Repair Orders.